in this way. So how does it feel to finally slip that ring and see it for the first time? Nice. You know, this is... Uh, you think about winning, you think about hoisting the cup, and then this is something that, that comes to mind. So, um, you know, it's a pretty nice ring, and uh, <laughs> I think everyone's pretty happy with the way it turned out. Is it big enough for you? <laughs> you tell me. That's uh, <laughs> it's a pretty big ring. It's pretty heavy, but uh, I don't know much I'll wear it, but uh, that's, it looks good on there. I was going to ask you how long do you plan on, on wearing it before the season starts? Because in some sports, they, they wear it. <clears throat> season starts sometimes they work during the season I would say uh, tonight and then probably won't see it on there for for a while um, you know it's, it's great to get it and things like that but like you said once you get uh, the season started you're you're trying to get another one so um, you know we'll enjoy this here tonight and guys will uh, wear it at different occasions I'm sure but I think for the most part uh, you know we'll keep it safe in a spot this kind of thing is nice but, uh, it's a tough <clears throat> days before the season. I know you guys are trying to put last year behind you and look ahead to this year. Is this just another reminder of last year kind of stunting the, the growth forward to next year? Yeah, I think at this point we realize that we've got to move on. It's uh, it's a great night, so you want to enjoy it, but I don't think anyone here thinks that uh, you know we've accomplished everything. You know, we want to move on and keep going, so um, we all know it's just going to get tougher, but uh, it's nice to enjoy it here and get the ring. So now you know if someone insults you, you go with the left and not the right. Uh, yeah, well, maybe the right. <laughs> maybe the right, judging by the size of it. Is it inspiring though when you put these rings on so close to the beginning of the season? You know, it's kind of motivation that you want to get another one. Oh yeah, for sure. It's uh, you know the whole the whole experience is, is motivation enough, not just the ring. So um, you know once uh, you get a taste of that, for sure. I think there's there's a lot of motivation, but. Um, like I said, you, you think about winning the cup, you think about just winning and, and all the things that come with it, I think, are, are just a bonus. And, you know, this is something that, that, you know, comes along with it. What was the ceremony like? Um, we just had uh, Mario and, and Ron Burkle ownership uh, give us the rings and um, Ray just inter introduced each guy. Uh, it was in numerical order, so <laughs> we had to wait to the end. And <laughs> I wasn't looking at anyone else's, but uh, it, was, it was pretty neat. Was it kind of reliving that moment, going back to that night, and you know, to this as a team? And yeah, we had, yeah, we had a little uh, little slideshow with photos and stuff. So, um, you know, showed each guy with with the cup yeah, in the yeah. summer. So that, you know, that really hit everyone hard. I think, and just you know, bringing back memories and seeing how special it was. But um, you know, as we said before, it's it's uh, past that point now. We've moved on, but this is a good way to kind of. Hold it off. Looking long term, you don't get to keep the cup, but this is something you get to hold on to forever. <clears throat> Even when your playing days are done, how big is that to hold on to? You show your kids and your grandkids. Mm -hmm. and yeah, exactly. This is something that, uh, as a keepsake, and um, you know, only the guys that you want it with have this. So you, you really share it with them. So I think that's that's the special part about it. There's 52 names in the cup, and I think 52 of these. So everyone who did that together. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll share that forever. Yeah. Can you hold it up again? Yeah.